Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a reading for Sign of Cancer, the Zodiac Sign, and keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. If you like a personal reading, that is going to be down below in the description, where you can find that on my website. This feels like there should be more cards in this deck, like there's some missing somewhere, but there is no cards missing, is the weird thing, but it just feels like they're, I don't know, it feels like less full than what it usually is, but there's no cards missing. But either way, um, uh, this will not resonate for all of you. If you like a personal reading, that's going to be down below in the description where you can find that on my website. You can find a bunch of other things there on that website too. It's free to sign up and join. So you can go, go ahead and go check it out. All right. But let's see, what do we have going on for our, our, our crabby cancers today? Okay. You're being told to remain focused here. Don't let, you know, people try to pull you off your path. Don't let people, you know, in their negative comments towards you, their negative opinions, pull you away from what you're trying to achieve here, Cancer. Continue to remain focused. We have the moon, but the moon is your ruling planet, so you'll always have that connection to the moon. But there's something, there's something coming in that's going to surprise you. So we have the universe coming in that's going to, going to give you a big surprise. Okay, this is like a blessing. This is something you don't expect to happen. Happens. Okay, look, the universe is working with you to bring this in. This is something you've been trying to make happen. It finally happens, Cancer. Here, this is what you've been studying for. This is what you've been applying yourself to. This is what you've been working towards here. You know. Okay, look, there's there's also some love that comes in for you. So if you're already with somebody, you're staying with that person. But if you're single, you have um, you have somebody coming in. Somebody here that's like a mirror of you. They're a reflection of you. They reflect back everything about you. So this is like twin flame type of vibes. Now, when we talk about what zodiac sign this person could be, they could be another Cancer like yourself. They could be a Pisces potentially here too because I see heavy Pisces and a uh, potential Gemini. So one of those signs, maybe they just have those placements within their birth chart, but this is somebody here that I feel like you have a lot of interest in or are going to have a lot of interest in here. You know what I'm saying here? Cancer, like I see, I see you liking this person and I feel like you're releasing all restrictions. You're releasing all binds on you. See, once again, this could be another Cancer like yourself here. Um, some of you guys may also have Virgo within your birth chart, but look, you're manifesting, you're manifesting what you've been focused on. See, you're manifesting what you've been focused on here, Cancer, what you've been trying, you've been trying to make changes. These changes are going to be happening here and you may be, you know, ending one cycle and going off onto the next cycle, going off onto the next chapter of your life. And you're going to have some miracle that is going to see once again, there's some hidden miracle, like there's some surprise miracle that, that happens. All right. Something happens, Cancer. I don't know what it is, but it, it's something you've been dreaming of, wishing for. It happens. You guys have been setting up strong boundaries with people around you, too. And a lot of you guys have been focused on your business or you've been, like, empowering yourself in some way. You've been stepping up into this leadership role here as well. And we have the rabbit. The rabbit is good luck. The rabbit is abundance. So that's what's coming your way is good luck in abundance here. Okay, look, what you want is just up ahead for you. You've been wanting it. You've been desiring it. You've been taking steps towards it. Here it is. It's it's just up ahead for you. Okay. You guys are also being told to dress to impress. You know, because they, there could be some important people you meet. This could be important friendships, important, you know, business relationships. This could be important romantic relationships. The list goes on here, Cancer. But you're being told to dress to impress because it there is going to be a lot of new opportunities being presented to you and you want to look professional. You want to look like you, you look, I don't know. I was the word for it, but either way you want to, you want to attract this in. All right. So continue to attract this in Con like dress for the job here, you know, play the part, play the role here. You know what I'm saying? Cancer others of you, this could be applying to something like love wise, so if you've been desiring new love, you know, dress up when you go out here. But if, you know, this could be something new for you in terms of like business here. But it, I feel this is something new that's coming in. That's going to be putting you in your feelings and you, in your desires and your emotions here. It's going to make you overflow with your emotions and your feelings here. So it just depends on what you've been desiring. All right, because everybody has their different desires. This is a general reading. It is not a personal reading. If you like a personal reading, that is down below in the description. But you're being led and guided here towards these new opportunities 
Queen of Swords. Some of you guys may have air within your birth chart. Air is Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But once again, I feel like you're going after what you truly desire for your life, Cancer. You see, these are new territories that you're stepping into. And you're just going for it. You're going for victory. You're going for success here. You're, you're, going, you're going for what you want. Okay? What you wish for. You are going to be getting here. Once again, I feel like you guys may have some heavy air in your chart. Air, once again, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Or some of you guys may be... Having an air sign coming your way. There's somebody here that misses their pet or their animal. A lot of you guys are also reconnecting back to your spirituality. Look, there's some love here that's happening for you. What you do with that, that's going to be up to you. But this is somebody here that's in their feelings about you here, Cancer. This is somebody here that's very interested in you. Okay, some of you guys may have options. Some of you guys may have a lot of people interested in you. Okay. But the way is clear for you to move forward in the direction that you want to move forward. There's like a contract coming up for you and the way for you to move forward towards that contract is clear, so to speak. Contracts in terms of your career, material assets, or it could be like a marriage contract, whatever. Okay, but I'm seeing you're about to be extremely blessed here. All right, you guys have a lot of money that's about to be coming your way here. And either you've been ignoring somebody or somebody here has been ignoring you. I don't know. There's some type of ignoring situation, like with an Aquarius. Either you've been ignoring an Aquarius or an Aquarius is, is ignoring you. But I feel like you guys are going after your hopes, your dreams, your wishes, your desires here. You know, maybe going after your dream job here. But look, once again, there's this ignoring situation. I feel like you're ignoring them. Mr. White, I don't know. You have your own reasons. Now, we do have the star. You know what? Actually, I shouldn't do that. We're going to go over here. We're going to go over to these cards, actually. So we have the king of pentacles. We have pentacles. I'm going to go over to my pentacles deck. Okay. See? You're going to have financial independence here. Once again, there's somebody here that's been watching you. You don't see them watching you, but they're watching you watching you like overcome every obstacle this could be a scorpio there could be a scorpio here that's watching you wants to invest into something with you okay yeah it could be work wise maybe they're at your work and they want to invest in something with you or this could be like a client or like a business partner here but they they're going to offer you something here some higher level of commitment maybe like working with them on something here try not to overthink things you're going to be fine Empress, whatever, whatever they're offering you is going to leave you like the Empress here, where you're going to, you're going to have this flow of abundance coming in. We also have you connected with your Venus sign. Some of you guys could also have Cancer within your Venus here, but once again, Chariot, Chariot is your own card. It is yourself. See, look, there's going to be blessings coming in that surprise you here. Some of you guys could also be traveling. There's going to be love. Once again, there's love. There's love. I also feel like you can be blocking people around you for some reason to why i don't know like i said you have your own reasons king of cups king of cups is yourself either male or female does not matter but i feel like you're kind of going distant towards some people and i feel like you're focusing on this love you're focusing on love your love life here so when i see you're leaping towards love but you're also unsure about it at the same time <laughs> Well, look, there's people coming in wanting to work with you. So I feel like you're getting a good reputation. You're building your reputation up, Cancer. There's people coming in wanting to work with you. There's clients, you know, there's all these all these things. There's um I don't know. There's somebody here that you're bored with, but there's generosity. Somebody here is coming in being generous. You're being generous towards them, they're being generous towards you. Seven of Cups, there's you're you're like, okay, so you're celebrating. Let's get, there's blessings coming in that you don't know about or you don't see right now, but you're going to celebrate these blessings when they come in. Look, there's somebody from the past that's trying to reappear back in your life. This is somebody that you were bored with before. They're trying to make a reappearance back in your life. They're trying to give you a gift, but I feel like you're not interested in, in that because it's like you've already moved on from that. And maybe this person of the past has betrayed you before, and I feel like you're just not interested in talking to them here. And like I said, you're off onto new things. You're, you're just doing you're doing other things um almost called you Aquarius no you're cancer here you're off onto a new beginning of your life you're you're experiencing new things here temperance some of you guys may also have Sagittarius within your birth chart but I feel like you're focusing focusing on what you want to get done you're focusing here on what you want to achieve in your life here too some of you guys may be focusing here on your business if you have a business high priestess you're moving forward with your intuition and you're going to be getting what you've been wishing for. 
which are changes. You've been wishing for changes. Changes are going to be happening for you, Cancer. Success. It could be success here. You've been wishing for the success. It's coming in because you've been applying yourself towards it. Okay. Now, since we're talking about business, I'm going to grab these cards. And we're going to pull like one here for you. So, tell me more on what we have for Cancer. That's more than one, but we'll just take the top one, which is diversify content marketing blogs photos video build the know like trust factor with your audience by be ubiquitous in your niche by sharing your content on diverse platforms okay so this is like this is like reaching people on all different platforms right so you're you're going to be if you have a business, you're going to be putting your business, okay, like your business page, business profile on like platforms like YouTube, like currently on YouTube. Okay? You got you got Instagram, you got TikTok, you got all that stuff. So you're going to be putting your your like brand on there. Okay? And you know I'm trying to think of the right words. You're going to be building your audience there, right? You're going to be building people that are going to be interested in what you're doing by, by just sharing what you're doing, okay? And sharing it in a relatable way, not making it like an ad. Because when you start talking like like ad and where you're just only selling things, that's when people become disinter disinterested and kind of click off of whatever you're doing. So, so sell yourself, but in a relatable way. Okay, my nose feels so itchy. It's annoying me. Okay, so either way, that is what I have for you. If you want to see more content for your zodiac sign, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And also go check out my website for even more content on there too, which you can also socialize with people on there if you choose to. If you don't want to, then, you know, whatever. Don't. All right, but anyways, that's what I have for you guys. And goodbye.